Introduction to Group 3 Elements of Boron Family A farmer named Ramu wishes to raise tomato crop in his farmland. In this direction, Ramu plows his field, sows tomato seeds and finally waters it. In few days, after seed gets enough sunlight and water, it germinates and then grows into a small plant. Now farmer adds urea as fertilizer which allows the plant to grow into a bigger plant and completes vegetative growth. In quick time tomato plant bears flowers which on pollination by insects and wind turns into fruits as red tomatoes. By seeing tomatoes, Ramu gets excited and expects a good ale. After few days, to his disappointment, Ramu observes few changes in the plants as yellowing and curving of leaves, shortening and thickening of stem, failure to set fruit and also found cracks on existing tomato fruit with uneven ripening, which really worries him. The farmer quickly rushes and brings one agricultural scientist to his farm and requests him to safeguard his crop. The scientist, after keen observation of the symptoms of tomato plant, concludes that tomato plants have deficiency of micronutrient called boron. He prepares a fertilizer for farmer by mixing 1 gram of boric acid and 1 liter of hot water and suggests him to apply in small quantities. After spraying fertilizer to his crop, the farmer observes new flowers more number of good quality ripened tomatoes gets a good produce and premium price for his crop. This story of farmer raising tomato crop tells us the importance of micronutrient called boron in plant growth, flowering and fruit bearing process in plants. Actually this boric acid spray contains a compound called boric acid with a structure shown. From this structure we may notice that boric acid contains a chief element called boron. This story allows us to introduce element called boron, a group 3 element and study about its compounds.